Welcome back, it's your boy Fresh. And I'm Mary, and we are a Coop of Nerds, and today we're going to show you our recent pickups. But before we get started, don't forget to give, to give us a like, a subscribe, and follow us on Facebook under a Coop of Nerds. There we go. So this is wrapping up the GameStop a thon. Um, I went a little crazy with the buy five, get 50% off. That's a good deal. That is a good deal. And then today, they had buy a new, get 50% off a used. So, I might have another package coming in the mail. <laughs> we'll see. I don't know. But, uh, are you ready? I'm ready. i got a healthy stack here, so we'll kind of burn through them. Uh, first, Diddy Kong Racing. So, this is... Like uh, the spiritual successor to Mario Kart. Mm -hmm. And we got Captain America and the Avengers. So this is a walk to the right, beat everything up. It's a uh, two player cooperative, yep. right? It's a cooperative game. Mm -hmm. Got Joe and Mac. I believe this is also a two player cooperative game. You play as a caveman. It's like a caveman platformer. <laughs> Next we got Batman Returns. This is uh Michael Keaton's Batman. Yeah. And Danny DeVito. Is that is Michelle Pfeiffer? Yes. Crystallis. Um I think I heard that this game is sort of a uh, Zelda kind of Zelda clone. It looks like it. Now, normally, I'm not a big Disney video game guy, but uh, Mike Matei from Cinemasker is always raving about this game. I've never even I've heard of it, never seen it. Ducktales. So I figured I'd take his recommendation. And uh, try that one out. He's always, he's always ranting and raving about that. We got Mega Man 2. The cover art is better than the first one, but he still has a gun. Mm -hmm. He's still like he's, I don't know, about 46. Yep. But that's okay. <laughs> finally, or finally for the Nintendo, The Punisher. So this is a... Uh, a rail shooter game. I know it doesn't have the best reputation, but sort of like, so you're just on this, you just slide back and forth and shoot these people. Oh, like Duck Hunt? Sort of, but you can still see yourself. And oh, okay. And the, I, don't, I don't know if the gun works with it. I don't think the gun works, works with it. Yeah, they call it rail shooter, so you're stuck on this rail. And okay. You just go and shoot up people on the screen, go to the next screen, shoot up people. Uh, unfortunately, this one didn't have a case. This is the only one that didn't. Uh, medieval. Or medieval. So you play as like a skeleton knight. Is this the one that you said is supposed to be similar to Diablo? No. Okay. No, this is a... Uh, yeah, I mean, it, it's an adventure platformer game on, on the PlayStation. Um, I think it's, it's always had pretty decent reviews, so. This is the Diablo clone. Okay. Which did not get good reviews. Darksiders Genesis. But I do love the Darksiders series, so I figured I'd at least give it a try. Um, but yeah, it didn't, didn't get the best reviews. And a lot of people will complain that the camera is too zoomed out. So, I don't know if... My TV is not huge, but yeah, it's a little bit bigger than most, so maybe it'll... It will be able to see okay. Yeah. This is the one Gears of War game I was missing. Gears 4. And, uh, you know, we can play this together, co-op. Okay. I I'll keep try. I keep mentioning it to you, and you just keep... I'll try. <laughs> but don't get mad if we die. <laughs> I don't get mad when we die. You get pretty mad when you're playing a game and you're not winning. 
That's not true. You yell at the TV. I, I can yell at the TV. I don't yell at people. I yell at the TV. <laughs> Is that, would you say that's fair? But if I was also with you on the TV, then maybe you'd No, yell I'd at still me. be yelling at the TV. I wouldn't be yelling at you. We got uh, Monster Hunter World. So this one looked pretty interesting. Um, yeah, it's a uh, once a once a decade. Elder dragons cross the sea, heading for the distant, unexplored continent. Drawn to this migration, you embark on an epic journey to unravel the mystery and dangers that lie beneath. Hmm. So I think it's almost yeah. It's like you're. Trying to fight these big giant monsters and the artwork, artwork looks really cool. Yeah, I thought it looked pretty cool. I, I ordered some of these a long while ago. I mean, that GameStop ad ended a while ago, but it just took forever for them to send me um, the games this time around. Friday the 13th, the game. Um, I'm not sure how how good the online community is. Um, I just wanted to try out the single player mode. You popped that one in, didn't yeah, you? Yeah, I tried this one out. Um, you gotta unlock all of his like, cinematic kills, so you kinda gotta grind it to get some of the cool stuff, but uh, we'll see. Then we got Shining Renaissance Refrain. So this is part of the Shining Force series. I was uh, my favorite role-playing game back on the Sega. I haven't played it since the Sega, so who knows what directions they went. I think it did say something about create music with the B-A-N-D system to enhance your powers. That's kind of cool. Man, it depends on... It sounds cool. Randomly bust out a, a rock band. Did it get okay <laughs> reviews? I don't know the reviews on that one. I don't think I looked at the reviews on that one. I just, I love that Shining Force series as a kid, so. It's 50% off when you do it. Then Devil May Cry. I think I got one, two, three, four. Um, so now I picked up five to uh, round out the series there. So those. Or our video game pickups, which one are you most excited for? Um, Donkey Kong Diddy Racing. Kong. Diddy Kong Racing. Diddy Kong Racing is um, the one you're most excited for? I, I was going to say also the, the Captain America one. Captain America. Because we can play that one together. Yeah. And then the, um, Darkness. Dark Siders. Dark Genesis. Siders one. Genesis. Yeah. If it's a, if it's anything like Diablo, then I'm gonna like it. Yeah, it, it's supposed to be very similar to Diablo. Uh, I'm looking forward to that one. Um, I already played the Friday the Thirteenth game, so I was really looking forward to that one because I love those movies. Um, yeah, and then I'll go with you on Captain America and the Avengers. Do some co-op games. She did pick up two board games. Um, this one, The Coldest Night. So, it's, it's like you're trapped. It's a cooperative game. One to four players, 14 plus, 20 minutes. You're trapped somewhere and you need to keep this fire going. And so it's like what kind of kindling you use, what do you burn, what order. You know, and other things can pop up to kind of ruin your fire. I thought that was kind of an interesting yeah. concept for a game. There's no monsters, or at least not that I'm aware Just of. Just the natural elements. Yeah, I think so. Oh, yes. And then this one is part of the next uh, installment of the Unmatched series, mm -hmm. Jurassic Park. So it's got Engine versus the Raptors. So it's that Australian guy that and gets killed by the um, Raptors. Then there's hints in there that they're going to have future Yeah, ones. so on the spoilers, if, if you don't want to know this, I don't, if you get this game though, it's, it's in the rule book, so I don't really do any 
deep dive research. But it looks like the next one's going to have the T-Rex in it. So... I'm not sure how big his figure is going to be. You'd think it'd have to be bigger for size, right? Right. But then, Would he fit on the board? Yeah. Was he just going to be tall? Because the board isn't real big. No. Mm -mm. So we might have to... That one's not a cooperative game. That one's... Nope, that one is competitive. Yeah, just head to head. Would you rather play as the hunters or the dra raptors? The raptors. Because in the movie, the raptors win. Yeah, but you can change history. <laughs> I'll probably still want to play the raptors. Are the raptors the good guys or the bad guys? They're the bad guys. I mean, they're just hunting. I guess. I don't know. I just figured <laughs> they're the monsters in the movie, right? So that makes them the bad guys. Yeah, but they're just defending themselves. Right. He's coming in to... Jaws is uh, the same kind of concept, right? He's just eating because he eats. Yeah. So, you could so is Jaws really the bad guy? No, Jaws is a good guy. He's a hero. All right, I'll do it for this video. We'll see you next time. Thanks, guys. Bye. Bye. -bye. Of course, Charles is a good guy. The dog keeps licking the alleys on my leg. Well, he's trying to make it all better. Yeah, kisses do help. I hate that signs. <laughs> you want kisses? You want to kiss my legs? No. I'm good. We went fishing and I think every gnat in the state of Indiana was on that lake. Do gnats just... really bite? That's the only thing I saw though. I don't... They, were they were really little. Little bugs that were biting us a lot. I think they're, I thought they were gnats. But... I was wearing jeans so I didn't, I didn't get my legs. I was wearing booty shorts so they go all the way up. <laughs> <laughs> you ready? Mm-hmm.